Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Bongo, bongo. Professor Pineco here, and here's another episode of Story of Seasons Trio of Towns. About animals. Morning, Panko. I hear you bought yourself some livestock. I figured I could give you some porters on caring, caring for them, so I came by. All right. Come with me, and I'll show you the ropes. Uh, uh Frank. Frank, I got it yesterday. I've already taken care of it. Uh, all, all right. Yep, we can do this. Never mind. Never mind, Frank. Mm. Sorry, I always move when the cow moves. It's just, as I said, the very first episode. I love that cow. There's a lot of different things you gotta do when caring for livestock. There's feeding them, brushing them, giving them milk, uh, giving them treats, milking them, shearing them, taking them out to pasture, showing them affection by petting them or picking them up, and talking to them just as important too. It's good if you take care of them every day. You'll get the best milk, wool, and eggs in return. Absolutely. Right then, let's get down to the nitty gritty. Just like I did for the crops, you can ask me a question about what you want to know and I'll give you an explanation. So what do you want to hear about? I love the option, saying I'm fine for now. Alrighty then, if you change your mind you want me to explain anything, come talk to me any day before 12 p.m. I reckon there's a lot of stuff to digest at once, so you have to ask me as many times as you need. That is the best tutorial method. Hmm? Let me give you these before I go. It's useful. What is he giving me? I got fodder! And chicken feed! And two thousand dollars! That's right, Frank, Frank ultimately gives you four thousand dollars. He gives you two thousand when you get your farm, and he gives you another two thousand when you buy your first livestock. And that's the money that he gives you to start up the game. I'll be heading home. Take good care of a livestock, you hear? I will. I love my animals. We received two gold, and our paycheck came in for two hundred and twenty gold. Yay! So that's the way it works. The paycheck automatically gets deposited. So let's go ahead and water our turnips for this morning. Oh. See, in my other file, I can water one, more than one at a time, so I just I pressed A in the middle of the two of them. It's going to take me a little bit to get used to the different things that I have kind of set up in one game to another. So we're going to go ahead and water and water and water. I think we've got a little bit of water left. I think we can push it. Can we water this radish all the way? Oh, no, it says I should refill it, and I'm not sure if we were done. So let's refill the water. Love that you have a water source in this game. And check. Nope, we were able to. So let's go check on Cluck. Oh, no. Yes, I will get rid of those trees, guys, but it's not really necessary right now. We got an egg for Cluck. We pick him up. Let's put him outside for the day. It's nice and sunny. They don't like going out in the rain or in storms. We're going to give Cluck a soft treat. And then we're going to go in. And I like to just feed up the, fo the food every day. I only do that when I have one animal, just like this. I love that there's already fields. You don't have to worry about Cluck running away. But you do have to remember to put him back. Okay, let's go talk to everybody. Because we want to make sure that we're maximizing that friendship. And we also want to pick up as many items as possible. And do those part-time jobs. So these are random NPCs. You don't have to talk to them every day. But you definitely can. It's completely up to you. Alright. Let's go. Let's go check out the stuff. Let's press A on all these butterflies. Oh look. Megan's whole family is over here. Let's say hi to Hector. He's feeling good today. Oh. What do you know? I actually feel good today, Pineco. It's amazing. And we'll say hi to these two kids. It's not safe to run here. I feel so good in the sunshine. La 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 la. We'll say hi to the bear. Nope. He still doesn't want us to say hi to him. And even though we talked to Frank this morning, it's very important to say hi to him. Sure got plenty of spunk. You bet I got spunk. So, we're in... The, we're in Weston, so now we're going to talk to Horatio and check on our part-time jobs for the day. We have weeders for Megan. We can ship any five flowers. We can ship five milk, two vegetables, or five eggs. That's a lot of things we can't do today. 
Now we can chip the flowers that we've got. We got the uh, wild flowers because they are flowers. So we're gonna accept the flower job. We don't have any vegetables to ship. We don't have eggs and we don't have milk. Now you can buy these things from the store, but I wouldn't suggest it early on in the game because you're not gonna get as much money as you bought them for. And we can pull weeds and that's a job that starts right away. Now weeds in, in the last game, if you've played it, were like really, really important. Like weeds were super, super important. Um, in this game, I did find that I ended up with way too many weeds because uh, you just, I don't know, it's making making fertilizer isn't, isn't quite as easy. I don't think making anything is quite as easy. You do need a lot more materials to make everything in this game. You'll see as we go along. So there we go. We did our part-time job of weeding. Oh, thank you, Pineco. Here, take your pay. 110 gold. Thank you, Megan. You can go ahead and keep whatever you collected. Thank you so much. So we got to keep those weeds as an extra bonus. So let's make our way back into town. Make our way back into town. You notice that the first couple of days, there's not much to do. But because we have those uh, extra money because we started with Tycoon, let's go ahead and check what the general store has for seeds. La la la, that's another mining point. There are four mining points here all together, which is really great. Um, again, just wait those three days and you get really nice stuff. So here is Miranda. First, we're gonna talk to her, then we're gonna buy something from her. You've got just about everything we need. We can expand the bag for a bigger bag. It'll come to a hundred, yeah. No, 10, 10,000, but we're gonna hold off for now. We don't need a bigger bag. We're gonna buy items. So right now she has radish sheets, potatoes, a pocket calendar, which you can get if you want a portable calendar, sparkly fertilizer, dry soil, soft soil, and solid soil. Now, if you're playing on veteran mode, you'll notice that all of my prices are 30% less expensive than yours. So just, again, I'm kind of playing on easy mode. So we're gonna go ahead and get probably about 40 fertilizer. We don't want to have to buy it again. We're going to pick up, um, how about four potatoes and maybe one more radish seed for that sixth spot. How about that, guys? Now, you need uh, dry soil, soft soil, and solid sand to make your farm circles, which is not going to be unlocked for a little bit longer in the game. So we're not going to buy those right now. Okay, we do have enough money for that extra bag. Maybe you could leave a note in the comments to see whether or not I should do that. So we talked to Carrie. Let's go in and talk to Lizette. Oh, welcome. What does Lizette have? Oh my gosh, it's the first time you've been to my store. Can I help you today? What would you like to purchase? Flowers, I would love to purchase flowers. Let's get two of each flower and not go too crazy. Can I help you with anything else? Nothing at this time, Lizette. Thank you very much. She is awesome. Lizette is who Mr. Pineco decided to marry. Oh, let's talk to Brad. Hi, Brad. What are you doing? The business is closed. Oh, it doesn't open until noon. Well, that makes sense. And let's say hi to Marco. Hey, Marco. Let Brad know if you need any, if you find anything new and inspiring for ingredients. He loves inspiration, you know. Well, that's good to know, Marco. That is good to know. Who have I not talked to? I haven't talked to Wayne. How will how will we ever get maximum affection points if I haven't talked to Wayne? La 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 la. Doo, doo, doo. Wayne, where are you? Are you eating? Am I friends with you enough for you to let me eat now? Oh, howdy. You need me for something? Hang on. I've been finished eating real quick. That's right, guys. So when you get max affection with people, you can start eating with them, which is super awesome. All right. Oh, look. We found some rocks. You know what rocks are? They're stones. And I find we have a lot of those. So let's check out these other shops today. We have Natasha. And what can Voss do for you this day? What would Voss like? So we have cinnamon and walnut that Natasha sells. And she'll end up selling eggs, milk, and other other things as well. What? For sure. We have Cortez. Oh, daily necessities. So what do you have? She's kind of like the general store, but she has grass seeds in case we want fodder. She has mint, chamomile, lavender, just really like general things that you can pick up. She also has those items in case you accidentally throw them out and she can expand your bag as well. 
And then we know the animal shop. We know Allison. So let's just check it out again. We have this cow, this cow, and this cow. So um, we also we also have all of our food. But right now, like I said, we're going to stick with our chicken. All right. Horatio didn't have any more jobs we could fill. Did we take any part-time jobs? <gasps> I should check the part-time job note. We sh we're supposed to ship five flowers. And we need to do that before 17 o'clock. Why don't we run back to the farm and make sure we ship those flowers. That's something that I sometimes forget to do. All right, did a quick cut and we're back to the shipping box. Let's go ahead and put in our five flowers. Hmm, I have none here. Let's hope that we have five in our box. Oh, we do have five flowers. Oh, well, they're called wild plants. Let's see if it works. Because they are flowers, but they are also wild plants. All right. So I did say in the last episode that I wasn't going to buy any more seeds, but I think that maybe because we have enough money, we'll be able to stay very well um, fed at the restaurant, which means that we should be able to use a bit of our stamina to go ahead and plant more seeds. Now, when it comes to raising the level of seeds, before uh, I like to only fertilize one at a time. Now, I had mentioned the fertilizer is actually considered a tool, so it is always in your quick menu. We're gonna fertilize that radish. Fertilizer also takes energy. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and hoe the ground here, and let's get some potatoes planted, and a couple of our, and, or a couple of our flowers. Maybe not everything today, but at least one of each. Yeah, I am feeling kind of tired because I have barely any stamina because I've just started the game. But thanks for pointing it out. We're gonna go ahead and just use at least one of everything because we need to fertilize and water it. And we can hear our chicken clucking. That's a lovely sound. Chicken clucking, chicken clucking. We love chicken clucking. Da 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 da. You're gonna notice that my stamina is gonna get pretty low. We're gonna speckly fertilizer everything. So there are different types of fertilizer in this game and as soon as they're all available, I will show you. Just so I don't forget to put cluck oh, uh, back in. We're gonna put him a, a put back in now. Cause you never know, I'm pretty forgetful. And now we're gonna start chopping down a tree. <gasps> do, do, do. One way to bring your stamina down really fast is to chop trees. You're gonna see the stamina go. Uh-oh, the stamina is going down. That's one thing we haven't done yet. We haven't eaten any of that potato bread. Uh-oh, I just threw it. I didn't eat it. Goodness gracious. Maybe I shouldn't have quick menued it. There we go, we're gonna eat it. We're gonna eat one potato bread. There, we got a couple hearts back and we're gonna work on this tree a little bit more. Working on the trees, working on the trees, working on the trees in our farm, farm, farm. Working on the trees, working on the trees, working on the trees in our farm, farm, farm. Good job. Now we got that broadleaf down. So we've put our first tree down. La, we did really, really good today. Oh, <laughs> so you'll notice that you get twigs when you chop the trees and you have to chop them one more time to get lumber. But don't chop them all on the ground like this. If you pick them up, you can put them down on a pile and you can use your stamina to chop them all at the same time. It's a much better idea. We're gonna go in here and we're gonna put the items into the storage box for the day, including our seeds, our extra seeds, our egg, which we're gonna keep. Our, we got 13 twigs and oh, 14 pieces of lumber from that tree, so we're definitely on our way, because we'll need that, we'll need that for sure. And it is only 15 o'clock, 15 o'clock, 15 o'clock, it's only 15 o'clock. I think we're gonna check and make sure that we said hi to everybody today. La la la, resident info. See, we talked to everyone in town, good job. And now, we're gonna run back to town and we're gonna eat something at the store. Again, I normally wouldn't do this, but since we have enough money to. All right, and we're up back at the restaurant. And Brad should be open now. Hi, Brad, are you open? We're gonna order food. 
Now, the thing I like about the Chef Special is there's all different kinds of food in it, so I tend to get that one a lot, just because you never know what you're going to eat. Ooh, this looks really neat. That's possibly a quiche. Hmm, nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Ooh, we got fishing power up. See the little fish on there? That means we got a power up from the food that we ate. We're going to take a moment, and I'm just going to talk to you about the power ups for the food. So this is the stamina effect, the fishing bonus. Fishing bonus will bite your, uh, will make fish bite your lines as quickly as they do when you go fishing after midnight. It's a great chance if you're, uh, great to have if you're participating in the Luli Kolo vi uh, Village Fishing Festival game. This effect is available on several pot recipes and some rice recipes. So if we had the fishing rod, we could do that. My favorite is definitely the running one, but we'll see it as time goes on. All right, everybody, we're going to wander back to the farm and save for the day. All right, when I got back to the farm, I realized we could probably use that stamina to cut down a couple more trees. It would be silly to just go to sleep. So we're going to take the axe and we're going to cut down some more of this broadleaf. It should take about all of our stamina to get down. That's A-OK. -okay. Because it takes 20 per less, 20 less stamina in seedling mode, which means we'll have this farm cleaned in no time. So it really is playing the game a little bit on easy mode, but also a more relaxed playthrough so that you're not as stressed out about not having enough time to do stuff. So we're going to go ahead and whoop, almost done. Boom. Okay, we're going to pick up all these twigs. Oh, there's Megan checking our shipping box. Oh no, those flowers didn't count as flowers. Boo doo doo. We failed that job. Part time job notes ship any flowers? We now have an X. So the recruiter's going to be a little bit annoyed at us, and we're not going to get any money. Okay, let's take out those twigs. Remove items from storage. Now, twigs can be used for things, but right now, all we need is lumber. So we have all of our, our twigs in our in our menu. Doo, 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 doo. We're going to place 30 of them. Bum, bum, bum. And then we're going to get out the, ah, uh, not the sickle, the axe. And there you go. All of them are small lumber. See how that's easier than running around and chasing each of the lumber pieces? I didn't know that for the longest time playing this game. Goodness gracious. So now we have 30 small lumber. We're on our way. All right, thank you everybody for watching. We're gonna go ahead and save in front of the bed here. This is the la- uh. Now that we're all saved, we're gonna end the episode. Thank you everyone for watching, and I hope all of your crops are golden.